lifetime achievement goes to Oprah Winfrey! <laughs> <laughs> well, <sighs> thank you. This is, this is certainly one of life's fullest circle moments for me because it's so true. We are all beacons of light for each other and I am grateful that Barbara Walters was there for me to be that beacon of light to become everything that I could become today. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Barbara. Thank you. Uh, I want to thank the Harpo family. I want to thank the King World family, everybody who has nurtured me, who has stood in the gap for me. Stedman, <laughs> you are the sweetest man with the greatest integrity. <laughs> I thank you for helping me, me be everything that I am today and that all that is to come. Thank you, Gail. <laughs> thank you, Maya. Thank you all. You know, when I, from the beginning, from the beginning, when I'm being uh, colored, then Negro, then Black, then African American child, growing up in Mississippi, my prayer was for as long as I could remember, God, use me. <laughs> use this life. I don't know what the future holds for me, but I know there is a vision for my life greater than my imagination can hold. Use me! Use me! What would you have me do? <laughs> and that dream, that desire, that prayer, somehow brought me to television. <laughs> tremendous vehicle of television <laughs> to be able to go into people's homes and touch their lives and be the beacon of light that Barbara was for me. <laughs> um, to be the light of hope and understanding. Um, to share some sense of the illumination that maybe sometimes helps reflect people's lives and maybe sometimes opens them up to themselves is the greatest blessing God could have given me. And I want to continue to use television as we become more polarized in this medium. I choose to use it whatever way I can. We can. To make people lead better lives. To lead them to the highest vision possible for themselves. That is the goal. I want to thank you for this award because it encourages me to run on and see what the end will be. Thank you.